What's up, YTPC? New to Cobbs. With uh, another video out of uh, Trump Tower back here. I sat back here this morning for a few hours. Nothing. I mean, a deer have to move sooner or later, so. Wife was sitting at home watching NASCAR. I said, well, if you're going to sit here and fall asleep, I'm going out to the deer blind. So, here we are. Uh, first, before I get to what we're doing, uh, housekeeping. I'm going to be smoking my bones short poker. But nothing's in it yet. And I'm drinking. Wait a minute. Let's, let's get First, let me tell you, my Zippo, remember yesterday, my Zippo, I said it took a shit. I thought it was because it got wet. Um, it's still my Camo Zippo, Camo Zippo, but, you know, I had the uh, pipe lighter insert in it. Well, it turns out it was the striker, not the actual flint itself, but the roller uh, will not strike the flint. I tried the flint out of this, I tried everything, it, it didn't work, so... I put the regular insert that belongs in here so I can use this lighter. Um, and I'm going to send that pipe lighter insert or that whole pipe lighter maybe back to Zippo and uh, I'll see what they do about that. But So anyways, that's why my lighter was giving me fits yesterday. Now on to, well, since we, you, you have to do housekeeping. So I got something else new. Uh, ran to Walmart today after watching a lot of YouTube videos. Um, I like coffee and sort of like the pipes. I like good coffee and my beer. I like good beer, so I like good coffee. Uh, I mean, just, you know, good old cheap black coffee is good too. But um, So I watch a lot of outdoor videos and stuff like that and uh, was reading up on or watching videos on... Uh, like coffee presses, French presses they call them. Uh, GSI Outdoors makes some awesome products from what I saw in the reviews. But then uh, a guy that did very good reviews on the GSIs also did reviews on a Stanley. And uh, Stanley Thermoses make one. And I looked on uh, Google to see you know where who had them. And uh, it turns out uh, the Walmart... Uh, in two towns over from us, so it was about 32 miles, but uh, it got nice enough today that uh, wife and I took the bike out, so we got a good 60-some mile bike ride in to go to Walmart and get a Stanley uh, French press, coffee press. Now, it's my very first time using it, so I'm not going to, I can't take it apart because it's full, but basically it's a thermos this lid screws off of it and there's a cage in there with a seal around it with a filter in the bottom of it. So you put, uh, I happen to get some Starbucks, uh, caramel, and uh, it says uh, like for a stronger coffee, put two tablespoons per six ounces of water. I think this is actually like 15 or 17 ounces. So I put four tablespoons in. So you put four tablespoons of the coffee grinds in the bottom and uh, we have a water dispenser at home that takes the five gallon jugs. So it spits out hot water like instantly, you know, we don't have to let it heat up. Um, so I filled the rest of the way up with that hot water. And then you take that uh, squeegee, you know, with the screen on it and stick it on top. Oh, I stirred I stirred the water up too, just to get the grinds, grounds mixed up. And you set a timer for three to four minutes. I waited four minutes and then you push that filter down and you're pushing the, all the grinds to the bottom and then you know your coffee stays up top um this is a little different than the the gsi ones they're kind of like two piece and they're plastic but i mean this is a it, it's a thermos brand and then uh to drink the coffee then you just unscrew the top and i'm not going to dump it and i did this about an hour ago at home and it's still hotter than hell i can't drink it <laughs> it's so that's going to be my drink of choice while we're out here. Now, back to the video. Like I told you yesterday, we're going to do a tin opening on the Sammy Ogawa with uh, Navy Flake. This was uh, another one of the tins that I got to, uh, in Indianapolis at that brick and mortar. Um, so this is a Virginia blend with Latakia, which I love. Uh, I actually kind of mix some myself at home. 
uh, with some straight lane Virginia and uh, it's not Lane Latakia, I forget which brand, but uh, I got that at that pipe show in Columbus. So anyways, let's see if we can uh, get that thing open there. Wow, that's like, look at that. It smells like a horse barn. Cattle barn, horse barn, hay. Like fresh cut hay maybe, you know, you just bailing it. Oh wow. Mmm, that smells wonderful. Look at that. So we're gonna get we're gonna get a couple pieces out here, maybe three. To get enough to put in that bowl. Now I don't think uh, I don't think this is gonna need any air drying time. I know people say fold it. I don't know if I really like that method. fold it and put it in there I might try that this time I've never done it like that so I think maybe we're going to do that Let's see see how that works I always do the rub I guess you should say so I don't know I don't really know how that's going to work That's a good draw. I guess we might as well just smoke it, right? I mean, we're here. Let's see if we can get this stuff lit up. Yeah, that's definitely not my pipe lighter. Looking a lot of air too. Let's see if we can get this pack down in there a little bit better. That probably wasn't the way to do it, but what little I'm getting of it so far. It's yummy. Yeah, it got to, I don't know, I think it hit 60 today, 61. It got pretty warm. It's nice riding on the bike. That's tasty. That's very good. Mm. Sam and Gallup, Navy Flake. Choice Virginia's blended with Latakia. And my uh, super hot coffee in my uh, Stanley coffee press, French press. Which is good. I, you, you can't beat fresh coffee like that. 
I mean, that's like, yeah. But it's hotter than hell. Holy shit. That was kind of one of the things that swayed me towards the Stanley because it's a thermos, it's hot. So I figure if, like this, you know, I make it before I go hunting, it's going to last with me out in the stand for an hour or two. Or I can make it before I leave for work, which I go to the gym for an hour before work. So my coffee would probably still be hot by the time I get out of the gym and got to work. That'll keep me from stopping at McDonald's and buying my iced coffee every morning. I mean, it's only a buck, but if you think about it, it's five, ex five extra dollars a week. Twenty bucks a month on top of your gym membership. Yeah, so anyways, I'm going to finish smoking this and then uh, let things wind down here and hopefully see something tonight. So I'll do another video on that Stanley uh, coffee press. Uh, actually, actually show how it all works and put it together to brew the coffee in it when I do it. Uh, kind of a how-to video. There's plenty of them out there, but I know, you know, pipes and coffee and teas and beer it all goes together so hey never can have enough knowledge right so i'm going to finish this pipe and uh hopefully uh something comes in tonight and we have a little action so uh if we do you'll get to see that too we'll talk to you guys later